What is going on, gamers? It's Jay Blake from MMO, and welcome to episode number 27 of my Subnautica playthrough. Um, I, in the last episode, we built this cool little base out here. Let me show it to you. Yeah. So you can remember, if you've been watching and following along. If you haven't, there you go. So we built this base so we could specifically upgrade the prawn suit and the sub without having to go back up. And now I have the thermal reactor on the sub, so we're charging all our batteries and charging everything. This is a perfect place to do everything I need to do to get down to the next part of the, the game, which is going to get me to the endgame stuff, which is coming pretty soon. We're getting through. We're getting there. We're almost there. Um, what I need to do in this episode is we're going to try and get the MK3 for the sub to get down to 1900, cause, or 13, 1700. Right now it's at 1300, and I'm already at 1 2, so I can't really go that far down. Um, we're close to the sea dragon, which we'll be eventually seeing. But for now, let's go ahead and do that. So let's go... What do we need? Let's find out what we need. We want to get the prawn suit MK2, which is in the modification station. Right here. Let's just look in there and see. I went around the area. And the last I left off, I was down at the prawn suit. I almost exploded my prawn suit because I was being stupid. Um, what I did... First, let's switch to the big screen. What I did was I um, went around this area and collected some materials. I collected some more titanium. It took me a little while to find it, so I'm happy I didn't stream it because it took me about 15 minutes. So that would have been boring watching me walk around looking for titanium, but I did find some. So I have that on me now, and I organized the ship a little bit again. What we're going to be trying to craft, I believe we're at MK2. We need the MK3. I have kyanite as well. So we need a plastil ingot. Oh, that's a lot of titanium. I don't know if I have that much. And then for the MK2, we need just titanium. Sweet. So we need 15 titanium total to do this. I don't know if I have 15 titanium. We might have to go find more titanium. Let's see. 5, 10, and 1. We have 11 titanium. So we're going to have to find some more titanium. Looks like we're going to be walking around some more. But first off, I guess it'd be the best thing to do is go ahead and do the sub. Because that's going to take the plastil ingot. So let's do the sub first since we're already okay with the uh, prawn suit where it's at to find more titanium. So yeah, I guess let's do that. Let's use all this titanium. <laughs> oh man, it took me a long time to get all that. And now I'm like, ah, oh, it's gone again. Just like that. Boom. And for plus steel, I believe we're going to need uh, two lithium. Okay, that's right there. Let's grab two lithium. Uh, one, two. And make the plus steel ingot. And then, what were the other things we needed? Um, kyanite, three. I actually have plenty. I've got two more kyanite. That's overstocked. There's nothing in there. I got two more extra kyanite, so we have enough kyanite to do everything that we need to do down here. And the other thing we needed was the MK module. This is going to be crazy because what I'm going to have to do again is like we did last time. I'm going to pull the depth module out of the sub. I'm going to run downstairs, craft it, and run back up here and put it back in. We should be okay. Just in case we're not, I'm going to hit save. <laughs> and we're just gonna do this. Are you ready? Take out step module MK2. We're gonna pull that out. Maximum depth reached. Just gonna I'll run downstairs. Down. Run to the machine here. Take the MK3. I'm gonna run back upstairs. No damage yet. And we're gonna throw it back into here. And now we can go to 1,700 meters with the sub. Perfect. Now it looks like we're going to have to go find some more titanium. Because we don't have any. Wait, what's it? I have one titanium again. So let's go find some more titanium. I guess that's what we're going to do. We're going to explore a little bit more. 
We'll hop back down here in the prawn suit. And we're going to go further in another direction. We're going to go this way this time. Because I've already gone the other ways. And we're going to have to go a little bit farther than I've been because there is no titanium around here. That looks like lava coming out of the ground. Oh, there's a warper right there, too. Okay. Oh, shit. We're in trouble. We are in some serious shit right now. You get away from that dude. That is not titanium, that's silver. Found out if you hold forward and left and right at the same time, you actually run faster. There's titanium. Look at that, first time, that was quick. Okay. Got lucky that time. Now we just gotta stand here for 10 minutes and drill. And hopefully, I'll be able to get enough titanium to do some shit. I'll check this out in a second. Let me see something real quick. Um, for this, there's a couple other things we need to build. I think I want to get a, a whole reinforcement, which is up here. Where is it? Where's the generic stuff? Here, this one. That one, we need three titanium, lithium, and four diamonds. We have that. After I'm done here, we will definitely have that. And I don't think we're going to need any more plastil ingots to do any of this. Five for that, three for this. Can I check the storage from in here? No, I can't. I have to get out of the suit to check the storage. Is that it? Alright, let's see how many I have. Let's hop out of the suit. Go ahead and repair the, the 2%. There you go. And we're gonna check the storage. Oh, uh, cool. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That's 12, 30, 14. We are fucking golden. Sweet. And there's more titanium right there. You know what? I'm just going to grab this because we're here. Might as well get as much titanium as possible because we're completely out of titanium pretty much. I'm sure after this, we'll be fine. We'll get to go back. We'll make the next upgrade. The MK2 for the prawn suit that I'm in right now. And we didn't get to bring the Seamoth down here. I'm actually thinking about possibly making another Seamoth while we're down here. But I don't know, we'll see how that how that works out. Right now we don't need it. Mm -hmm. Just keep going, titanium, come to daddy. Daddy likes the titanium, okay. There's another one right here. I'm going to grab it. That's silver. That looks pretty good. What is that? <clears throat> That's a wreck. That's way up. Okay. Let's go back to the sub. What's the wait? What's that? That is. That's not even harvestable. Oh, that is. That's um, it's gold. That is gold. Let's grab the diamond. Why not? It's there. There's silver. There's quartz. A lot of big, uh, big stuff down here. A lot of big nodes. That's more. Oh, wait, is that titanium too? Holy shit! I think it is. We're doing it. Because if I do make the other sea moth, we're gonna need shit tons of titanium. Cool, 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 cool. I'm excited. We are going to be completely set now to get to the precursor base, which is where we're going to be heading. Oh, out of room. Um, but there's a couple on the ground here, so I'm just going to pick them up. 
And looks good to me. All right, let's roll. Let's get the fuck out of here. Look. It's all crazy ripped open. That's good enough. Let's go back to the sub, which is that way. That doesn't sound good. That warp is over here too. So I wanna try to avoid it at all costs. If that warp pulls me out of here, uh, anything could happen. And this is a uh, fucking fire rock shooters. What the hell just happened? Oh, did I like blow up a mushroom? I don't think so. Where'd the sub go? There's a warper over there. Comes the lava coming out of the ground again. It's a warper right in front of me. Uh oh. Oh, he's getting close. If he pulls me out of here right now, it's gonna suck. Get back up in the sub. Oh. Slow down. Right here. See if I hit it up right. Oh, beautiful. Awesome, 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 awesome. All systems online. All right. Let's go ahead and grab all the titanium out of here. That's not what I want. Oh yes. Beautiful. So sweet. All right, now we can make the rest of everything we need here. Do I have the kyanite on me still? No, I don't. Um, let's see, what we need to make is the MK3. We already did that for the sub. We need the MK2. We're gonna need five titanium, two lithium, and three kyanite. Could have sworn I pulled the kyanite out, didn't I not? Or maybe, I know I used it. One, two, three. So we, oh, we need to put something in here. Let's just throw some titanium in here. We'll put 10 in here. There we go. One more kyanite. And lithium, I believe it said. No, wait, we have lithium, though. Oh, the uh, MK1. <coughs> Which I gotta pull out from here. Oh, yes, this is badass. All right. We're getting places here. Let's grab the MK1. And let's grab the stuff to make. I want to find out what else we need for the uh, reinforced hull. Uh, well, lithium and four diamonds. Let's go grab three more diamonds because I have one on me. One, two, three. I think I need more lithium. All right, boom, make that. And we'll just kind of hop outside real quick and swim over to the base. Welcome aboard, Captain. And we're gonna make this guy right here. We need it for the thermal. Computer chip and Pollyanna, fine. Let's go do that to them. Make the computer chip and the poly on. Um, computer chip, what do we need? We need for the computer chip, which is not there, it's here. <coughs> two table coral, golden copper wire. So, copper two. Wait, did I get two? Yeah, I did. Um, Gold and table coral. So I think I only have two left, which will be fine. I have three, but that's all I got there. Let's make the computer chip. What do I need? I have to make the copper wire first. That makes sense, right? So wheat is a computer chip and polyethylene. Polyethylene, we need 
hydraulic acid, um, which I do not have any of. Uh, so deep shroom and what was the other thing for hydraulic acid? I don't remember. Uh, salt. Oh, I need three deep rooms. I only took two, didn't I? Yes, sir, I did. Okay. And I just need one gold. Gold. Basic. No, I'm making the poly up. Okay. Awesome. And let's go ahead and swim back over to the uh, base one more time. And we'll make the engine efficiency module. That's not actually what I wanted to make, um, but that'll work. That'll good enough. I was gonna make the thermal charger, but that'll work for now. So let's go reinforce the crap out of the suit by putting in that and that and the MK2, which now this baby should go down to 1,700 meters. Bam. Oh, yeah. And I should drain way less power. I believe now I can go down into the fire without burning out. Let me try this. It's just a quick test. I'm looking at my... Nope, I still... Still burn up like crazy. Oh, yep. And that guy's eating me, too. So let's just throw him up in here for now. And let's see what else I need to make now. So there we go. This guy's ready to go down 1,700 meters. I believe I can repair this from here. Can I not? Health 85%. Why can I not? I swear to God you could repair this from here. You used to be able to. Or at least you can do it with the Seamoth. I guess you cannot repair the prawn suit. Unless you're in the water. Which is kind of lame, but let's just repair it here then. All right. So we. Let's get back up in the ship. Now let's take a look at some of the things that I want to make now because we're pretty much like legitly good now. I've got everything fully upgraded, including the Seamoth, which I don't have with me, but it's fully upgraded where it is. So that is pretty awesome, actually. Let's fill these up. Throw the extra seeds in here, just have backups in case I fuck something up, which I tend to do quite often, so. Cool, 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 cool. All right, so let's sit down here for a second and let's look through our, our book and see what else we want to get crafted here. So, let's just take a look at everything. We don't really need nuclear reactors and stuff. I have not made those ever. Can make an alien containment. Not down here. I'm gonna make an alien containment back up at the main base once we go back out. Mm. I don't have a repulsion cannon yet, but it, it looks like I don't even have the uh, blueprint for it, which is interesting. Unless it's under modification station. Yeah, there it is. Haven't made a repulsion cannon. Seamoth all the way upgraded. Cyclops death module all the way upgraded. We have MK2 and MK3. 
Um, whole reinforcement. It's a Seamoth so charger. Seamoth. I have to make those later for the Seamoth. The Prunset Thermal Reactor might be something I'm interested in doing to keep it powered. We can make that. Um, deep shrooms and salt. Is that what we need to make the hydraulic acid and then gold? We can make this. Two kyanite and a wiring kit. We can get rid of the engine efficiency module and put this in there in its place. Let's do that. Let's make the prawn suit thermal reactor. It'll stay fully charged when we're chilling down here. Let's go. Prawn suit thermal reactor. We need two polyon, which is hydraulic acid, which we just did. We're going to do that again. What did we need for that? We needed deep shrooms. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. I can get more deep shrooms down there because we know they're right under the sub, so that's cool. Um, and what was the other ingredient? I just did this and I don't remember. Um, okay, so two salt, two gold. Two salt and two gold. Let's grab two gold here. Grab two salt here. Oops, shut the door. And let's do that. Make two of those. Make two of those. And where do I make the engine efficiency module? Oh, the modification station. <coughs> Probably. No. And a wiring kit, two kyanite. So wiring kit is two silver. And we need two more kyanite, which is right here. I think, I'm guessing I need to go back to the moon pool, basically. This. Let's see if that is correct. Prone suit modules. Oh shit, I didn't make the wiring kit. Stupid. My bad, Z's. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Alright. Oh, no, that's not what I want. That's what I want. Let's do that again. Prun suit thermal reactor. This will keep my prun suit completely charged. You know, what I realized I don't need a hatch on this base, so we're just gonna take that back. And then when I come back, I'm gonna do some glass. We'll do some windows real quick. There we go. Now, what we can do is we can put the engine efficiency module that I have in here. I'm going to actually make another container. I don't need to make another container. We're going to call this one mods. And we're just going to grab the engine efficiency module out and put that in there instead. We'll put the engine efficiency module in here for the Seamoth for later. If I make another Seamoth, we'll have stuff to put in it there. Okay, so let's look again. What else is it that we need? So that's cool. That's all Seamoth stuff. I'm not going to worry about that. Could do torpedo arms. Yeah, right now it's not that important. The grappling arm would be nice. I have a grappling arm now, so I'm not to worry about that either. Um, Cyclops upgrades. We have the shields. We have this. We have that. We don't have the sonar, but we don't even know the sonar, so it doesn't really matter. We need to find the, the blueprint for that. Or it looks like one out of two something or just one no I, I can't read even though it's right in front of me um wow I could use some water filtration systems copper wire and aerogel yeah 
And containment, we're gonna do when we go back up. Do I have everything I need in the sub? We don't have a power cells in the sub. Do I want to do power cells in the sub? I could if, if, since we have the heat generating down here, we can actually have those charging constantly when we're in heat. But if we're not in heat, though, it's just a waste. I'm not going to worry about that. Can make some picture frames to put some of our awesome artwork into the sub. All right, I guess that's literally everything. We have everything. We have everything in the game, pretty much. There's some things I need to craft, but I'm not going to worry about it right now. I mean, just to have. Um, we have everything we need. So let's, let's, let's listen to this at the next episode at the beginning. Let's go ahead and move on in, then. I guess uh, we're ready to go. Yeah. Um, you know what? I need to make some more decoys. Decoy, decoy, decoy. Um, yeah, let's do that. What do I need for decoys? Let's come on back down to the crafting station. Um, I believe they're here, right? Yeah, titanium and a wiring kit. So let's make one, two. Let's make two wiring kits. One, two, and let's go ahead and make some more decoys. I think we got three for each, so that's three. And that's six. So, wheatness. Uh, let's go put those into the decoy bay. One, two, and put these in here for now. Okay. That's it. We're done. We're going to start moving. We're going to go on an adventure now. Finally, finally. Let's put the titanium in the titanium container. And the quartz. Oh, that's folded up. Put it in overstock. Boom. Boom. And that's a lithium. Throw that into the lithium container. Awesome. 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 Let's save it. And let's go ahead and move on forward just a bit. Let's kick off our lights. So we can see a little better. And... Let's hit this bitch. And we are going to go ahead and enter fully into the lava zone. Oh, I got some power drainers on me. I think it stays hot enough down here. I'm not going to worry about it right now. But we do want to do something about that eventually. <coughs> and we should be coming across... Some pretty crazy shit in a minute. In fact, this may be as far as I want to go. If you look in front of me, that giant lava castle. That is kind of the center of the world. Um, we don't actually need to go there because I already have kyanite. That's usually where you would go to get kyanite. Um, these suckers are fucking attacking the ship. We're going to go... Down, down, down. Since we have the full range sub, we gotta be real careful though because we are now in the shit. Okay, so. We should be seeing some pretty scary shit in a second here. Let me see if we can find them. You hear them? I hear them screaming. We want to get down. I'm going to go down deeper. And I might end up 
killing us right now, but that's okay. It's for a good cause. I'm looking for a specific place, but we're also being very wary of where we are right now because we are not alone. That's all I'm really gonna say. <coughs> we are not alone. Oh, there we go. There you go, right there in front of me. That is the infamous sea dragon. It's right there to our left. We're gonna go ahead and drop down even lower. We're gonna attempt to go right under this, but we're probably gonna end up getting killed. That's okay. Where we wanna go is down here. I'm just gonna go right on through here. And if the sea dragon catches us, we're gonna die, so. Let's just start dropping down into the craziness. Up, oh, yep. It's very possible that this is the end, friend. All right, we're good. We're red hot, but that's okay. the sea dragon is very pissed I don't think he's following us oh, he's right up there he wants us dead for sure we're just gonna keep going and pretend like he doesn't exist so here we are in the lava zone and it's gonna keep spawning a little bit more. There's the sea dragon. He looks like he's still onto us. But he might, is he coming at us? No, I think we're okay. Oh. I am what you seek, want to help you. And that is where the story is about to begin in the next episode. That was a short one, I think. It might have been short. But we are pretty much where we need to be for the next part. I think... Let me go ahead and save it right here. Make sure I'm okay. And I'm going to go ahead and keep going just a little bit. <clears throat> and see if I can not get down in here. Sea Dragon's probably going to attack us right now, and that's okay, but if you notice down here, there is a massive precursor base. It's right there in front of us. I'm going to go straight for it. And we may actually make it. We're going to find out right now. It looks like the sea dragon went back up. I'm kind of assuming that we're about to get eaten by the sea dragon, but he's not here for some reason, which I'm accepting. I'm afraid if I leave my sub out here, it might not be here when we come back. So let's go park the sub in that little uh, in cove over here. Right here around this corner. I'm gonna drive it in here and park. Nice little heat vent parking spot just for us. And this looks like it could be a pretty safe place. Uh, let me pop on here, see if we can spin this bad boy around and park it the right direction so we can bone the fuck out when it's time to go.
I don't think the sea dragon will come over here. I think we look like this is a pretty safe spot. I'm gonna go ahead and save it. <clears throat> and this is where we're going to stay until the next episode. There's only one more thing I need to do before I end this. Oh, wow. My uh, sub's damaged. Okay, well, there's a couple things I need to do before I save this, apparently. Uh, let's First, let's go out and fix the sub. That seems like a good deal. And pop this open. Oh! I'm burning up over here. Uh, let's go ahead and knock these power guys off. Uh huh. Wait, is the sub taking damage where it is? I'm not seeing any, uh. Oh, there's some. <coughs> where else? It says I'm getting hot, but it's not really taking anything from me, so I don't think I'm actually in danger of getting hurt. It's just doing that. My life is still pretty much full. The reinforced diving suit is pretty powerful. It. I'm thinking that that's the only uh, issue with the sub. I think it's just these guys that I'm freaking out about. Dead? Yeah, it's dead. Okay, any more? <laughs> it's it's kind of funny that it's like, ooh, like I'm getting hurt, but it's really not doing anything to me. And I'm pretty sure that we're good here. Right? Let's go back up and check the uh Check everything out. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Okay, we have some suckers on the ship still. There's two on the windshield here. Two, three, four, five. There's five of them. Uh, they're taking battery power, but I think that's all they're taking. And since we're in the heat zone, we're not losing battery power. So I don't really need to take care of these guys. But, you know, let's just get rid of them. Because they shouldn't be. Did I just hit the sub? No, I think he did. I don't know. I think that guy hit the sub. Looks like there was two on the bottom down here. There's one. Sorry, I had a sneeze a Rooney. Um, now it's starting to take a little bit of life. I said five. Did I get them all? Oh, eh, that's not a sucker. Oh, there's one up here. And there's one right here. They just swim up. They're actually still alive. They're just going to come back down and get stuck to the ship again. But Alright, so let me get back in the sub. This red hue going on in here. And I'm. Let's look at that. There we go. I still have one sucker on me. Whatever. Fuck it. I'll get him later. So I'm going to sit down here in the chair. Look at this beautiful active lava zone. Some kyanite down there, too. I'm gonna hit save. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Keep in mind. Hey, thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. If you like what I do, please hit those follow, like, and subscribe buttons. It'll help me out tremendously. And also, for our Discord, the podcast, past streams, and all our other social media, you can always check out the website at www.mmoing.ga. Thanks again.